Finding the right products to sell in your dropshipping store is a never ending journey. And that is why we're doing everything that we can to help you understand what are the best products for you to sell in your e-commerce stores. And now we've kicked it up a notch and we're not just sharing with you what products you need to sell, but also what sellers are selling this product, what their websites look like, what ads they're running to sell this product, and also where they are sourcing these products from. Now, there's a lot of work that goes into this product research method, and we're more than happy to share it with you. So enjoy the top 10 products to dropship in August 2022. This is the best value when it comes to product research. Quick intro and let's go. Welcome back to your number one source of knowing what are the best products to sell in your dropshipping stores. And now we're in the month of August. So without further ado, let's kick it and jump straight into the action. But one second before that, if you haven't done so yet, subscribe to our YouTube channel to always stay updated on all of the latest and all of the hottest topics coming out in the world of dropshipping. That being said, like and share this video if you appreciate the value. And now let's dive deep down inside and see what are our best products for August. Starting with our first one, walking sandals. Now, many of you are thinking, wow, what a broad and general item. But there are many different types of walking sandals and this one is a hot seller. Let me show you exactly what I mean. So everything that I'm going over in this video, you can also read about it in the blog article, which I'll leave a link to right below this video. But of course, I'm always going to provide more and additional bonus value into these videos. So of course, stay tuned if you're the type that likes to watch. So what's so special about these walking sandals? Let's take a closer look inside. This seller is selling these sandals for $66. He's buying them for less than $19, making a potential profit of over $47 in every transaction. Now, of course, this doesn't include selling channel fees, but with $47 in profit, selling an item that only costs you less and $20. It's okay if you even profit $5 less from selling channel fees, but that comes with a certain percentage and it really depends on what selling channel you are using. So take that into consideration. We always have a lot of potential profit minus the selling channel fees and even after. The target audience to sell these sandals is both male and female in the ages between 25 to 50 years old because this is the average age for parents to buy things for their young children. And of course, we're looking at marital status of married and single. Even though we like to visualize that most parents are married, there is nothing we can do about it. Almost 50% of people who get married end up getting divorced. So we have to target the both married and single audience and parental status, parents of young girls. So that is the way that you should target your audiences when selling products like walking sandals. Now let's get on to the good stuff. So who's selling this product and how well are they doing? Let's take a look at the seller's Facebook ad. You can have a screenshot right here. You can see it from the blog, but I'll just click on the link below and open it in a new tab where you can see it better. Now, granted, the engagement is not huge on this product like we have in other products that I mentioned, but if you click on their main page, their main Facebook page, they're called Nubella Official, and you can see that they are a footwear store with over 3,000, almost 4,000 people who just like this page. So they already have a huge audience that's already engaged with their brand. And you can see that it is a Chinese company. So if you are not Chinese, if you're American, or if you live anywhere else around the world, you can make a much better page than this Chinese person who's running this page. But on the other hand, you can see that they are active and there is interaction with their Facebook posts. And once again, you can see that they're very, very active. They're launching posts all the time. They have a large following that's ever growing. And if we click on their website, so here you'll also be able to find those specific sandals that they are selling for $66. And I can see them right here. It looks like they increased the price to $71. So that gives them more potential profit. Now, keep in mind, the prices that you're seeing can change change by the time I'm recording the video to the time that you're watching it. Sometimes their links can change and other things. So keep that in mind when watching this video, when reading the blog article. But when we created the blog article post and when I'm recording this video, of course, everything is relevant and active and should be at least for the most part when you are watching this video. Either way, this will give you great social proof to everything that's working and whatever is also not working for some of these sellers. So if you look at their website, it looks clean. It has a very professional look. 
They upload all of the product's information the right way. They leave product reviews on the bottom, which adds more social proof to give the buyers the confidence that they need to check out. And they have all of the different variations and the different colors in their website. So once again, as you see, everything here looks clean. You can tell that they're running this website on Shopify just by the layout, just by the theme, which is good enough. And they also have promotion codes, as you can see here. And overall, I think they're doing a great job in the layout of the website that on the one hand looks very clean, and on the other hand, everything that you need, all the right information is shown right in front of you. So there you have it. They're selling it for $67. They're running Facebook ads on this product. And now let's take a look at where they're buying it from. So I'm going to click on the same item on AliExpress under the supplier's website in this product. And as you can see right here, those two variations, the same exact product we just saw in both white and black. And if we just choose a size, for example, let's go for the 27, which I saw that they had there. And they also have a size info. By the way, I did not see this on the seller's website. So make sure that you're grabbing all the information from your supplier's website, especially when it comes to sizes, because you want to reduce the amount of returns that you're getting because the customer purchased the wrong size. And we can see that we have free shipping to the United States. And this product costs $16.68, which is less than what we have in the blog article. So the seller on AliExpress reduced the price by the time I recorded this video. And the seller on the seller's website increased the price, which gives you even more profit, more profit potential, or an easier way to get inside this competition and rake in more sales by lowering the price just a little bit and creating a much better website and product page. So there you have it. That's item number one. Let's continue down the list. Before we do that, I want to remind you guys, you have many suppliers out there. It doesn't start and end with AliExpress, but here I want to show you guys the highest profit potential that you can make from every order because I am seeing a lot of drop shippers who are trying to profit 10% or just a couple of dollars for every order. And I'm here to show you that you can make much, much more than that, just like I'm doing with my stores, just like these sellers are doing with their stores, and just like I want you to do with your stores. Our second product on the list is Arch Support Foot Insoles, as you can see right here in front of me. Now, this is another very popular product that's been selling for a while now, and there are always new variations that are coming out to this specific item. And if I just scroll down a little bit, you can see that the seller is selling this product for $32, He's buying it for less than five, making an average profit of about $27 per transaction. Now that's pretty crazy when it comes to it, right? But that is the dropshipping business model. The target audience that you should target if you are running, of course, PPC ads on this product are both male and female when it comes to gender, since we can all have back issues, am I right? And the ages should be between 21 to 65 because, hey, back pain can come at any age, even starting from 21, and you can even drop it below to 18. Marital status, of course, both single and married people have back problems. There is no distinction between them. And the occupation type is usually people who have office jobs or people who travel a lot and spend a lot of time outdoors, walking, running, and more. Let's analyze the seller's Facebook ad and see how well this product is performing. So here we've got some great engagement, as you can see right here. The lowest price, but the best quality, get your now. So even their spelling and their grammar and their spacing isn't the best. And they are making a lot of great engagement selling this product. So do you understand where I'm getting at here? You can do a much better job when you try to sell these products, when you see what these sellers are doing right, and also when you see what these sellers are doing wrong so that you can improve it and make it even better and get those sales and once again, do a much better job than these sellers who are already doing a good job themselves. So as we can see here, we've got almost 3000 likes, over 300 comments and over 2 million views on this product. Now let's click on his website and see exactly what we're looking at. So he is selling it for $24.99, which is less than what we can see on the blog article, which is priced at $32. And that is usually because sellers like to add a shipping price when you continue to the checkout process. And as you can see up here, you've got free shipping on orders over $40. So if you as a buyer, you're only purchasing one unit at $25, you will be charged shipping, and then you'll get to this price of $32. Now, if you are the seller and you're giving free shipping, and you're also not being charged for shipping yourself, then no harm, no foul. And if you have free shipping and you're also charging for shipping because they didn't spend enough on your website, that is more extra profit in your pocket. So we saw the seller's website. It looks pretty good. I don't really like their name, top, top, top pro. 
I can tell that it's probably another Chinese agent trying to create an American brand. And the website looks okay. It's kind of screaming at me with all of its colors and designs. It's kind of yelling out all kinds of different things. I don't think that this is the best design that you can come up with. I'm sure that you can do a better job, but one thing that he is doing right, he's using a Shopify app down here, as you can see, where I can add this product to my cart no matter what section of the page I'm on. So if right here I'm reading about the sizing chart, which is important, as I mentioned, it's important to show sizing charts when you're selling things that people are trying to wear. So if I'm here and I decided to add it to my cart, I don't really have it. I don't have the option. I need to scroll all the way up here and I need to add it to my cart. And as you can see, when I'm up here, I don't have that pop up down here. It would be annoying to see the add to cart in two places. Once again, if I'm down here, if I'm scrolling down and I'm already convinced, hey, I've got the button right here. So I'm not going to miss it. Right. And that's one thing that the seller is doing well, along with the things that he's not doing well, which I already mentioned. So you can see that that's how much he's selling the product for. Now let's see where he's buying this product from and how much he's profiting. So I'm going to scroll down to the supplier's website and I'll click on the high art support insoles on AliExpress. So if we look here on the seller's website, you can see that the product we're looking at here is the same exact product that we're looking at here in AliExpress for a dollar and 79 cents. Now, granted, we don't have free shipping, but hey, how much are we paying for shipping here? Zero dollars and 77 cents, even though it's not the best because we don't have tracking. We always want to choose a shipping method where tracking is available. No matter how much it costs, you can look for other sellers who can maybe charge you less for shipping. But in this example, we're buying it for a dollar and 79 cents plus another three dollars and 77 cents, totaling about five dollars and five and a half dollars. OK, it should be around there. And as you see from our blog article, we've got it at four and a half dollars. So give or take a dollar. It really doesn't matter when you're making about twenty seven dollars for every transaction. And that is how much this seller right here is making. The next item on our list are polarized sunglasses, not your average sunglasses. Let's take a look. So this seller is selling these polarized sunglasses for thirty six dollars. He's sourcing them for less than eleven $11, leaving him an average profit of about $25 for every sale. The target audience that you should be targeting when running ads on this product is usually males between 18 to 50 years old, single and married, and those who have office jobs, which means they need to commute out in the sun. And if they especially like being outdoors, like if they enjoy camping, going to the beach, pool, etc. Now, for those of you who are wondering what this target audience means, this is for those of you who are running drop shipping stores on Wix or Shopify or any other place where you don't have free organic traffic like you do on eBay or Facebook Marketplace. If you're drop shipping on places like Shopify, Wix, WooCommerce and so forth, you have to make sure to bring traffic to your website. And one of the ways to do that is through PPC ads. Now, if you want to learn what that is, and how to go around it, simply head over to our website, hover over resources and click on ebooks. Here you have an ebook called eight steps to run Facebook ads for your e-commerce business. And here you're going to learn how to do it from A to Z, how to run PPC pay per click ads to bring traffic to your website from the relevant audience who wants to purchase your product. So you're going to learn everything there is to know over there. And if you're not drop shipping, as I mentioned, in marketplaces that give you free organic traffic like eBay and Facebook Marketplace, you will have to learn how to target get your audience and how to create successful ads, which this free ebook will help you to do in eight simple steps. Now let's continue down to the seller's Facebook ad. Once again, you have the link in the blog article below. You can also check the engagements by checking out this screenshot right here. But if I'll just take you to it right here, you can see that he's got over a thousand likes, over 60 comments, 70 shares. That is good enough for me to know that this seller is doing a pretty good job selling this product. And even though he didn't really write an eye catching description because he is targeting the audience the right way, he's still going to make those sales and you can make much more sales when you realize the mistakes that he's making and you do a better job than him. Now let's check out the seller's website. So you can see it right here. He's selling this product for $29.99 and he's offering free shipping on orders over $59, even though here on top it says free shipping order over $35. So once again, grammar mistakes up there. Very confusing because here it's telling me $59 and here it's telling me $35. So what's the right answer? And that is something, of course, that you can do a better job on right here. Also, buy two, get seven second with a spacing issue by three, get third at 60% off with a spacing issue here. Anyway, you can tell that English is not his strong side. He doesn't write a lot of product description, as you can see here, but he's doing everything else pretty well. And I've said in my previous videos, in my previous recordings, even if you do a bad job on your website, if you're not good at spelling, if you're not good at grammar, 
if you're selling a product that people are looking to buy and you're targeting the right audience, you will hit those sales and you will make profit. But you can make much more sales and much better profit if you do it the right way. You got the right product information. You've got upselling, cross-selling and everything else that we teach. So once again, I'm showing you things that are working for other sellers and what you can do to make it work even better for you. And that is how this seller is making $25 profit per order. Right here, we've got once again, AliExpress. Let's click on that AliExpress link that we have in the blog article, and you will see the same exact variation for those polarized sunglasses. Right here, we can purchase them for, let's see how much, shipping to the US, free shipping, final price, $9.17. And that is even a little bit cheaper than what we have in our blog articles, since once again, sellers and suppliers change their prices from time to time, not by a long shot, not by a lot, but still they change it. And don't worry if you see some small changes by the time you're watching this video. So there you have it. Great sunglasses to sell in demand. And that's working pretty well for a seller who doesn't know English too well. Next product are hard knuckle tactical gloves. Here's what the product looks like. Let's take a look at the information. These babies are selling for $55 a piece and they're being sourced between 15 and 16 dollars leaving you almost 40 dollars profit for every order the audience that you should be targeting here are both male and female age 21 to 65 years old both single and married and usually matches those who have occupation types or who enjoy activities such as biking motorists hunters and so forth let's take a look at the facebook ad that this seller is running because he's doing a great job when it comes to engagements. So you can see a screenshot right here. It looks pretty crazy, but let's take a closer look. And as you can see, everything that's working well for this product. He has a video ad which shows everything that this product is doing to solve a problem that you're having. For example, the people who want this product have a problem. They need very high quality gloves that can withstand many hits many knife cuts and many other types of damage. And as you can see right here, that is exactly what we are seeing. So if you have this problem, you watch this video, it's already solving the problem that you have and it already makes you wanna buy it. So the video here is very convincing and having a good video ad is something that I always recommend, especially if you watch our free about 40 video Shopify course. This is something that I mention a lot throughout that course. But check out the engagements here. 19,000 comments, 19 million views, 138,000 likes. But Liran, what if this product is really old? What if no one is actually buying it? What if it's from a year ago? So that is why in the comments section, you wanna click on the comments, click on most relevant and move that to the newest comments just to make sure that this product is still working today or a week ago or two weeks ago and not just from a year ago. Now it's dead and no one is looking for it anymore. So as you can see, people are still writing messages in the past week, which means People are still interested in this product. Don't mind Will Smith slapping Chris Rock here. We've already seen that. And I don't know what that has to do with this product unless they want Will Smith to wear these gloves. The engagements here are incredible. And if we scroll down to the seller's website, you can see that he has this product in a few different variations, but you can see that they all pretty much look the same. They just have different colors. And now I will show you the supplier's website. Our best friend, AliExpress. You can see that you can buy at least three different types of variations from this seller. And you have lots of sellers on AliExpress. So you can find, of course, the other variations that the seller is selling. But this specific seller is selling them for $14.67 with another 30 cents for shipping shipping with tracking available. So at another 30 cents, we're at about $15. That's how much this product is going to cost. That is how much he is charging. So as you can see right here, $15, selling for 55, making $40 per order. And with this amount of engagement, even if you add a two to 3% sales conversion rate, which really isn't that high, you can get a small indication of how much this seller is probably selling and profiting, which is pretty crazy. The next product on our list, luxury feather floor lamps. This is what the product looks like. Let's take a deeper look inside. This is a high ticket selling product, meaning every time you're going to make a sell, the profit is going to be huge, but it's also going to cost you a lot. And it's going to, of course, cost the seller even more. High ticket products are good to have in our stores for our overall profits. But most of our sales are be going to coming from cheaper items because more people like to buy cheaper items and they like to buy expensive products. But does that mean that we don't want expensive products on our website? Definitely not. They're what's going to give us the big profit at the end of the month. So this product, is being sold for almost $1,700 and being bought at around $1,050, giving you a potential profit of over 
dollars per transaction. So even if your store is making lots of sales per month from all kinds of low to medium ticket items, you only need to sell a couple to a few of these to really make it to the high numbers. And that is what this seller is doing. To target the audience for this feather lamp, you want to look for both male and female ages 21 and 65, single and married with special interests like furniture collectors and people who like luxury items. Now let's take a look at the Facebook ad that he's running for this product. Let's take a look at the engagement for this very high ticket and expensive item. And as you can see right here, 25,000 likes, over 2,000 comments, 3 million views. You can be totally sure that this seller is making quite a few number of sales from just this item. Let's take a look at their website. So of course, I'm gonna click on the link in the blog article and we can see that he's selling it. Let's see if there's an update here. Uh, we're seeing the NIS and I don't have the US currency right here. He's not giving us the option, which isn't that friendly. So let's go back to the blog page where we can see it in the USD currency. So he's selling it for uh, almost $1,700. Let's go to the source website on AliExpress. Here we found the item, the same exact leather lamp that he's selling. And we also have them in more variations here. Let's see if he's got these variations here too. Yep, he's got a different variation. So of course you wanna add that too. It's not that friendly to show it in this pop-up screen, but of course you are going to do a better job than this seller. And let's see how much we can buy for exactly with the shipping price. So first of all, we're going to change it from resin to copper because that is what the seller is selling. And we want to sell the same exact thing. And he's selling the 180 centimeters. Let's just make sure that we are not making any mistakes here. So yes, he's going for the copper body material and he's selling 75 and 120 centimeters, which is a little bit different than what we're seeing here. This seller is actually selling you a bigger leather lamp. And of course you can continue searching AliExpress. This is just one example from a quick product research session. But as you can see right here, this seller is selling them at 180 centimeters and 80 centimeters for the smaller variation. Okay, now let's go with the higher one. So copper and 180 cost $755 where he's selling it, let's make the calculation here. Okay, let's keep it on this color. And we're at 5730, which is about 1591 in euros, which also doesn't help. He's not doing a good job converting the currency that you wanna see, but let me just give you a quick calculation. So 5730 divided by about 3.4, about 1,685. So that is very similar to what we had in our blog article, 1,670. And the source price is very high on our blog article, I can see that the seller already reduced the price here, which is even better for us, $754, including shipping. Oh, that's the thing, it wasn't including shipping. And now if we add another $172, because we wanna ship with tracking, because God forbid that the customer opens an item not received case, and you can't prove that it didn't breach him because you don't have tracking information that he can track, you're gonna lose the case and refund all of that money to the buyer. Now you're going to reduce the chance of that happening when you provide tracking information. So 172 plus 754, puts us at $926, which is still a little bit lower than what we have here by about $100. So your potential profit is gonna be over $700. Like I mentioned, you might notice some changes. Maybe by the time you're watching this video, the price will be back to a thousand plus dollars, but you're still gonna make at least $600 in profit when selling each of these feather lamps. And this seller, once again, is doing a pretty good job at it. Just check out by the amount of engagements that you have here, people want this product and they are purchasing it. The next item in our list are reusable and eco-friendly pet hair removers. This is a great item to have and it does exactly what it says that it's gonna do. It simply helps you remove pet hair from your pet and it's reusable, it's eco-friendly, it's what the world is looking for. The seller is selling them for $23, he's buying them for $5, leaving him a potential profit of over $17 per sell for this very, very cheap item. Target audience, both male and female, 21 to 65, single and married, with a high interest in pets. So let's take a look at the Facebook ad that this seller is running. As we can see right here, about 300 likes, 60 comments, 38,000 views, not the biggest amount of viral engagement that I've seen, but definitely more than good enough to know that this seller is making some substantial sales and profit from selling this product. So now we can see this product right here is exactly the same product that we're seeing on their website. So let's just click on shop now. And here we go. This is the product on their website. And here is the product on AliExpress. Okay, you can see that it's the same exact product, $4.82. Let's add shipping with tracking. That's another 50 cents, no big deal. So here we're paying less than five and a half dollars and we're selling it for 23. $17 is great profit 
for selling a product that costs about five dollars even in brick and mortar stores you don't make this amount of profit and this seller's website looks very clean as you can see he's trying to create the whole brand design around this product everything is nice and pink and clean he is doing a good job showing the product why do i need the pet lint roller so he named his brand after the product and he's pretty much making it a one product store. And he's telling you right away why, why you need this product, what problem it's helping you solve, getting down to the top features and benefits, and of course, showing you screenshots, great explanations, a step-by-step -step of how it works, what you are getting inside the package, and of course, the guarantee and social proof, which gives you the confidence that you need to proceed with the checkout process and purchase maybe even more than one unit from this product. If I was a buyer looking for this product, this website would definitely convince me to do so. And here he's got all of those reviews simply by using a review importer app from AliExpress. And you have enough free apps like that on the Shopify app store. So another great product in demand with great profit. Of course, you don't have to import the same exact product. You can try different variations, different sellers, different strategies, and different regions to target to when running your ads. Next, we've got heated hand therapy electric massager. That is exactly what this product does. And if you haven't heard about it before, let's take a look. The selling price here goes for $90 for this specific seller. He's buying it for about $53, making a profit of around $37 per transaction. Here you can target both male and female, once again, ages 21 to 65, both single and married. And this fits anyone who is working remotely at their home, in an office, students, online classes, physical classes, anyone who uses their hands a lot to write, to use the computer, the mouse, the keyboard. This item is good for them. Let's take a look at the Facebook ad and see the amount of engagements that we have right here. And as you can see, another video ad, I'm gonna click on play. I'm going to reduce the volume so that I can continue talking. And as you can see, once again, he's showing you what problem this product is helping you solve. And if you don't have videos for your ads by your suppliers and you still wanna have a video for them, I go over that also in our free Shopify course. So do not forget to check that out. And once again, everything here looks pretty good. I don't like the text uh, font and, and colors that they're using, but you can always make it better. Here they're giving you a lot of explanation. You should make it a little bit shorter and you don't have to capitalize the first letter of every word when you're writing out these sentences. So of course, there's many things that you can do better here. The engagement here is okay. Once again, not the best we've seen, but we do see that this product is in demand. Now let's check out the seller's website. And as you can see, they are selling it for $90. They, of course, are using Shopify. You can just tell by the theme. There's a little bit too much blocks of text, which should be broken down into more paragraphs. But overall, he's doing an okay job. Having an FAQ, a frequently asked question, is a great way to also answer the customer's question so that he can purchase a product from you instead of moving on to the next website or sending you a message and waiting for you to get back to them if they will even wait. It's also good for SEO to promote this website organically. And he's got more information like shipping and delivery, which you should just have links on top with it and the logo here, which doesn't look that good. So this isn't the best job I've seen, but he is able to make some sales on this product. And you should also take a look at that too. Let's take a look at AliExpress's website. So here you can see that I can buy the same exact product for $43.67, including free shipping with tracking available. So that is your price anywhere in between minus your selling channel fees is your profit potential. Product number nine is a sunflower fidget ring, another popular item that we sell that is working pretty well for other sellers. Let's see what we have here. This ring is being sold at the seller's website for $31. It's being sourced for just four. So the potential profit here is almost $27 per sell. The gender here is more for females. Don't try selling this product to males. You won't be making that much sales conversions. Anywhere between 21 to 60 years old, single and married. And you can also try targeting mothers of daughters. So mothers who have daughters who might want to buy this as a gift, but also to men who want to buy it for their significant others, for their girlfriends. Let's check out the Facebook ad that we have running right here. So here's the seller's Facebook ad. Let's click on play. So you can just hear from the audio that he's using a text to speech. Okay, it's very similar to how you can edit videos on TikTok and add Add the uh, text to speech and he's simply doing it because the Chinese seller who's selling him this product didn't provide great information especially not in English so he did some editing here which also makes the video unique to him which is something that I also recommend you guys to do in our free Shopify course and we also have more methods there on what you can do to get videos for your ads even if you don't have any videos from your supplier so here we've got over 600 likes 28 comments over a million views this product is popular. Let's see how much he's selling it for. As you can see right here, $26, 
not that expensive but we've got free shipping on orders over 35 dollars so we are going to pay a shipping price if we order only one unit so instead of it costing 26 dollars it's going to cost 31 dollars so another five dollars for shipping and on aliexpress he is sourcing this product for about four dollars so let's click on the right variation which is this one you can see it's the same exact product and we're going to choose a shipping method with tracking and you can see that he's buying it for two dollars and 38 cents shipping costs a dollar and fifty Altogether, it's about $4, and that is the profit potential that you can make right here, about $27 per piece. Last but not least, men's mesh patchwork elastic curved hem vest. Say that five times in a row and let's continue. So this product right here is selling for $33. It's being sourced for less than 15, leaving you with a profit potential of $18 per sale. The target audience right here, pretty obvious, but it's male. 21 to 40 years old is the usual age where this product is being purchased. Marital status, both single and married. Time to update your wardrobe. Buy one, get second at 15% off. Once again, grammar isn't really that good. Spacing issue right here. Not a native English speaker. You can do a better job and get to even more audiences. However, check this out. About 10,000 likes, over 2,000 comments. This one is pretty popular. Here's the seller's website looks okay looks pretty professional it's a black and white theme there's not too many mixed colors jumping in front of your face everything here feels like it belongs in its place so good job with the layout of this product all of the variations that we have right here and of course we have promotions if we buy more than one unit so it's all nice to see we've got a sizing chart very nice very clean very understandable and you also have related products so you can tell that this matches a certain style that men like it may not be for every type of male but there is a large large audience that is looking for this you don't always want to sell something that matches the whole world it's almost impossible to find those types of items and you'll always be able to find a certain market and products that that certain market is looking for and just check this out so again he's selling it here for 21 bucks a pop and of course you're going to pay for shipping unless you buy for over 80 dollars so instead of paying 20 dollars, you're going to end up paying 33 dollars and he's buying it for $14. Let's check out AliExpress. So here you, ha you have the product for $10.49. Let's just add a variation, add a size, and see how much we have shipping to the United States with tracking available. So here's $2.54 plus $10 leaves you at about $13, which is a little bit less than what we have here. Because once again, sellers change our prices all the time, leaving you more profit in this scenario. So your profit potential here is almost $20 for every sell from this seller who's doing a great job selling this product, even though they are not the best when it comes to English, writing the product's description, and of course, optimizing the product page to make it really good and professional. Like we've got spacing issues once again right here and more spacing issues. Suitable type fit, what does that even mean? So you're just copying the information from AliExpress and pasting it without really optimizing. So when you look close, you'll always see something that you can do better to do a better job than the excellent job that we are seeing happening right here with the amount of engagements and sales. That sums up the products for August. I hope that you found it informational. And once again, if you did, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like and share this video if you appreciate the value. And don't forget to check out the AutoDS all-in-one dropshipping solution where you can easily scale your dropshipping business and there is no better way to do it of course, you cannot do it manually with quick product imports, automatic orders, price and stock monitoring, price automation settings, customer service, virtual assistance, a product research tools, and so much more. So if you're serious about succeeding with your dropshipping business, head over to autods.com, read about all of our features and benefits, start your trial, take it from there, scale it to the moon, and I cannot wait to hear about your success story. Thank you for watching and good luck with your dropshipping stores.